Read G for general audiences. It was a moonlit night and Henry was working with Edward. The big green engine was taking a goods train to the station by the lake. Whenever that owl hoots, a mist rolls in, murmured Edward. There's a legend that when the mist's about, there's a ghost about too. Take care on the old line, Henry. Stupid bird, said Henry. Owls, mists, ghosts. Edward's going soft in the boiler. There's no mist. But Henry was wrong. What's that? cried Henry. It's an amber lamp, murmured his driver. That means proceed with caution. Who's there? No one replied. Henry crept slowly forward. He stopped by a tree. It had a sign nailed to it. Beware of the viaduct. The driver was surprised. No one warned us about that before. And look, the signal's red and the gates are closed. And there's a fogman's coat. But where's its owner? Then they saw a light move within the station building. G -g Ghost! exclaimed Henry. Edward was right! Something very strange is happening, says Driver. I think it's best we go back. So do I, agreed Henry. By morning, the mist had cleared. A workman was talking about the unsafe viaduct. Lucky you didn't cross it last night. Yes, but we don't know who warned us, replied Henry's Driver. Later that day, he spoke to Henry. The viaduct is in repair. We can take our train back along the old line tonight. Henry didn't really want to. So he went into a site to rest where he saw Gordon being prepared for his nighttime express run. Feeling scared of ghosts, are you, Henry? teased Gordon. I'm not, huffed Henry. See you later then, halted Henry. <laughs> Gordon puffed away laughing. Stupid Gordon, what does he know? But secretly, Henry was still feeling very scared. But when nightfall came, he was sizzling nicely. Suddenly, an owl hooted, and then Gordon thundered by. Said a truck and the others giggled in their silly way. Be quiet, snapped Henry. I am not scared. But he was. A little later, the fog came down. As they approached the same area, they saw the amber light again. Here we go, said Henry's driver. Then, unbeknown to Henry, the gates mysteriously closed by themselves, and the signal went red. The trucks had seen all, and they were spooked too. Faster, faster! There's a ghost about! Stop! Stop! yelled Henry. A mysterious figure watched Henry go by. Ahead was a landslide blocking the line. Henry braked hard, but the trucks hit some of the rubble and plunged into the ravine. <coughs> Just then, Henry's driver saw a strange sight coming towards him. What's that? He said. The fireman laughed. That's our ghost. It's Old Bailey, the fogman. Old Bailey was very cross. Oh, George, sure worry about the void up. Why didn't you pay attention? We're sorry if we acknowledge your warnings, replied the driver. Is there anything we can do to thank you? I'd like to operate Don Station again, if you let me. I promise we'll speak Henry. And in a little while, Old Bailey's wish was granted. 
You and your station will be really useful, said the Fat Controller. Let's hear a hearty thank you to the friendliest, uh, ghosts on the island. Everyone cheered, especially Henry, who was the happiest of all.